2024 marked a crucial year for China to make itself a space power. During the 2024-2 sessions, commercial space industry was included in the government work report for the first time as a new growth engine, signaling the start of its rapid development. But what is commercial space industry? It refers to the development, manufacturing, launching, and application of space technology and services through the commercial market. In January 2024, the Li Jian-1 Y3 carrier rocket, developed by CAS Space, carrying five satellites blasts off from the Jiu Chuen Satellite Launch Center in northwest China. Commercial rockets such as Jiu Chue, Guizhou, SQX, and Ceres had all been successfully launched. Last November, China's first commercial launch site in South China's Hainan province started operation, marking a significant breakthrough. This milestone strengthened support for rocket and satellite launches. We aim to attract foreign customers with services such as satellite deployment and rocket launches by enhancing our capabilities, particularly through cost reduction and service quality improvements. Now, let's delve into China's Lunar Exploration Program. In May 2024, China announced plan to send astronauts to the moon before 2030. All the prototypes are currently being built. The, the current plan is to have a rudimentary form of a permanent sort of a lunar station. Uh, that station will consist of few sort of uh, components launched separately in the next four, uh, next two or four missions. I, I think it's a viable plan and it is certainly going ahead uh, quite rapidly at the moment. Last June, the Chang'e 6 mission successfully collected and brought back nearly two kilograms of lunar samples from the moon's far side, specifically from the South Pole Aitken Basin. This region is the largest, deepest, and oldest basin on the moon, and it holds crucial clues about the compositional differences between the moon's near and far sides. These samples will help scientists uncover the moon's evolutionary history. Let's take a look at China's space station. In two years of full operation, 181 scientific and application projects have been carried in orbit, with nearly two tons of scientific materials delivered and almost 100 types of experimental samples returned. More than 300 TEBs of scientific data has been acquired. Five astronaut crews, with 15 astronauts in total, have spent extended periods aboard the station. Besides their meticulous research work, they've also had time to plant space gardens, exercise, and even get haircuts on board. Space technology is a crucial area for technological progress and innovation. The ongoing advancements in China's space capabilities have significantly boosted national pride and confidence.